Gezi, first of all, happy birthday and congratulations. An absolute belter of a game there. 10-9 victory. Just sum up how you're feeling for us. Yeah, I'm happy to get through, but I think I put myself through the ring. I bombed chances early on and then, you know, Gabriel got, got, got in front of me and then he's full of confidence. But I think if I hit my doubles early on, like I have been, you know, most of this tournament, then it's a different game and I wouldn't <laughs> wouldn't have to go to those uh, down to the well and put, pull one out. But yeah, I'm, I'm happy with a win and a yeah, nice 11 dart at the end because I think I needed it. 6-4 down, are you scratching your head here a little bit thinking, how am I in this position? Yeah, obviously, but I was always confident that I, that I was outscoring him and yeah, he took out a 1-2-7, I think, um, early on in the game. and I, I was only on 80, I missed the treble to set it up. But you know, He was playing well, he was scoring well and he was taking his opportunities, but I wasn't taking mine early on and towards the end I was and then that's what got me over the line. Does that just show how far you've come, that mental resilience that you've now got? Because that last leg, just absolute when you needed it. Yeah, but it was always good that he, he didn't hit the treble off, I don't think, or maybe 96, I'm not sure. And then I go 140, 180, 127, <laughs> and the game's a lot easier then, you know, when you're going for doubles and you got a bit of a cushion. But early on, he was right behind me, putting me under pressure, and that's what I missed. But thankfully, I'm into the next round and I'm still in with a chance to pick up the trophy. It's been a good 20 minutes for Wales. Obviously, your teammate, Johnny Clayton, nine darter, I'm winning as well. But we heard a bit of um, swing light like there with the crowd giving you a little bit of um, fun banter for a change. Yeah, well, I don't know if it's banter or fun. I, I don't like it. But, <laughs> no, fair play, England deserve to win today. I think it, like I, I won on the last leg. I think another two minutes and Wales probably could have pinched it as well. But you know, hopefully now they'll back it up with a win next week against Scotland. Um, a bit unsure whether I'm going to play in a pro tour or go and watch them. I'm not sure. I might have a weekend off. In tournaments like this, is it important? Obviously, you've played first. Now you get more rest time than everyone else because obviously tomorrow's a big day, so you're going to need to recoup and save energy. Yeah, but no doubt I'll probably be on last tomorrow and then last <laughs> in the evening if I win and just messes it up that way. But yeah, I'm just happy to be in whichever way I play and whichever, whichever um, if I'm first, second, third, or fourth, I'm not bothered as long as I'm still in. Cool. Just good. Yes. Yes. Go ask the question, how amazing is it to play in front of that crowd? It's basically like half a Wales are here tonight. I was singing Swing Low. <laughs> oh, <laughs> no, it's, it's good. Like yeah. it? the, the last couple of months has been good for me anyway, whether it's, whether it's you or anywhere else. I've, I've, had a, I've had a lot of support, especially out in Belgium last week, apart from the semi-final against, <laughs> was it Van Dusenbode? But <laughs> I don't mind that. I like it when I'm up against it sometimes. It gets the blood boiling, gets me going and makes me play a little bit better. But I'm just happy it's not a week in, week out anymore. But 114 in particular that had happened. How big is that? Those checkouts for you? Yeah, and definitely. For the when you've got one data, is it, they are the tough ones. And well, for me, they seem to be the easy ones. They always go in. But then when I get three, three and under, I seem to bomb my chances. But yeah, I'm, I'm lucky that I went in, and I'm, luck, I'm thankful that I had a good last leg, and he didn't play as well as he had in previous ones. I'm just looking back on the Ricky Evans game earlier on today. Really good performance there as well. Two contrasting games if you like really good game there between the two for you and then a scrap to get through in that one yeah, but battle hardness I played well in, in all three games that I played and the difference is the first two games I played I took my chances I think I was like 9 out of 10 doubles or 10 out of 12 doubles I mean to finish but then today I was just up against it just not, not taking my chances and then you put yourself under pressure I think if I hit my doubles early on then I could have won this one comfortably as well but I just put myself under a lot of pressure but sometimes you need a game like that to, to, to get your fire going and yeah, I'm happy I'm through and maybe have another game like that tomorrow. We'll see you tomorrow. Thank you. Thank you.